A lot of people don't know that Grand Junction has had a mass shooting. But we have, we've had a mass shooting. And I think that had a big impact on this community. Never gonna forget that day. I think about it now and this kind of blows my mind. It's at Stoker Stadium. Just got done doing a live shot and I see one ambulance, two ambulance, three police cars and a fire truck heading east on North Avenue. And Stoker Stadium is about a half a mile away from the East Gate. So I got in the live van, got on the radio and I told Mona something big was happening. Started setting up the van, had a photographer show up. He started shooting some video and he lost it. And I knew that this video had to be done. So I grabbed the camera from him and I said, you go get in the van, get away from here. Don't look at this. I will take care of it for you. And now sitting back thinking about it, now it's having an impact on me now, but not back then. Because I knew I had a job to do. When you're a photographer, you gotta suck it back. You can't let those emotions come out. You gotta suck it back and you gotta get your job done, regardless. You may see the most horrible things in your life. And that was one of them. Five people died that day. You can't internalize that stuff. I sit here and talk about it now. Yeah, I'm gonna cry about it. Because you hurt for those people. I've seen everything that you can imagine in the news industry. It's all there. You've got hurt, but you've also got happiness. And I'm taking out more joy out of this job and doing what I did. In 25 years, I haven't worked a day in my life, Brian. I haven't worked a day in my life. And I just want to thank everybody here at the station for your compassion, your understanding. And just being there when somebody needed, if I needed to talk to somebody.